enough for this 400 final with Sonia Richards Ross in lane five and Francina McCrory in lane six. And in lane four, Debbie Dunn, the 2010 U.S. champion, who finished eighth at the 2008 trials, looking for better results here and a trip to the Olympics. And Tom, just like in the men's race, where Merritt and McQuay were kind of separated one and two, just like in that race, Debbie Dunn probably represents the favorite in terms of getting that third spot, but it is not going to be easy. There are several women in this race who are going to be vying for that final spot. We expect, we expect Sonia Richards-Ross and McCrory to be in the lead. Sonia, since the Olympic Games in 2008, went to the World Championships in 2009 in Berlin and won her first world title. That's the one major title that she has. And then last, she had a very up and down season, ran very well, but was not able to duplicate that sort of form at the World Championships. So it's really a case this year of, it is really just up to Sonia. With the sort of form that she's been displaying, only she can get it her own way. And thus far, she has done a good job of managing her season as well as her nerves and performing well. She has a recent best in the 200 meters. That indicates that she's ready to run something well under 50 seconds flat. Her husband, Aaron Ross, has a Super Bowl ring, two of them with the New York Giants, now with the Jacksonville Jaguars, and already has been okayed to go to London if right. Sonia makes it to the Olympics. And here's the 400 women's final underway. And Sonia Richards-Ross off to a fast start. Already uh, starting to make up the stagger on McCrory. Now McCrory kicks it in. Yeah, McCrory had to respond because Sonia ran right up on her. And now McCrory is stormed down this back straightaway. And she leads at 200 meters with Sonia Richards-Ross and Debbie Dunn giving chase. McCrory has the lead. Richards-Ross and Dunn as they come out of the turn and hit for home down the home straightaway. Francina McCrory. And now Sonia Richards-Ross right up to Scallons and goes right on by. Sonia Richards-Ross takes over the lead and starts to pull away. Pulling away, Richards-Ross is going to win it. Dee Dee Trotter gets second, and McCrory is third. So, Tom, the first two women across the line, Richards-Ross and Dee Dee Trotter, have just made their third consecutive Olympic 400-meter team. That was a phenomenal run by Dee Dee Trotter, who has not Tennessee, and she will be going to London as well. McCrory holding on to third. And here's Francina McCrory right there. Here's Sonia Richards. And coming off the turn, McCrory had a nice lead. But look at Dee Dee Trotter on the outside of your picture on the left. She fought past Francina McCrory and Debbie Dunn. Sonia Richards was gone and headed to the world's fastest time. Sonia across the line first, Dee Dee Trotter second, and McCrory paid for a really aggressive first half by finishing in third and falling apart a little bit at the end. But Sonia Richards-Ross on her third consecutive Olympic 400-meter team, and she will head to London as the favorite. 49.28 equals the trials record set back in 1984. So Sonia Richards-Ross continues her outstanding 2012 season by winning the Olympic Trials 